For part 5 of our series on building Microsoft Access Database Dunder Mifflin, we will create a home page for our user interface. This UI will provide our users with selections to navigate the database once complete. You can see from our example that users will be able to open the forms that we have already created by selecting buttons on this home page. The home page is basically a form that is formatted for the purpose of the UI. We start by going to create and selecting blank form. We can then add combo boxes, text boxes, or buttons as desired for your home page. For our example we will start by adding a visual for Dunder Mifflin to provide a unique view for our database. This can be accomplished by selecting insert image and choosing a JPG or picture file. From the properties menu, we can make changes to the background color to provide further formatting to our home page. Now we will add buttons to our home page for our users to select in order to navigate through our database. To achieve this, we will select a button object from the top menu and choose where to place this on our form. This can be accomplished more easily by toggling to the design mode of the form. The setup wizard will assist in creating the button. You can choose the open form as the command to be activated when the button is selected. Once created we will be able to resize the button to the desired size and shape. We can also change the name or picture that is in the button. If we now toggle from design mode to view mode we can test the button to make sure it is performing the desired action. In our example this would be opening the transaction entry form. After further formatting of our home screen, you can see what a final version might look like when the steps in our video are followed. You can be creative with your database and make your home page as detailed and interactive as you choose. If you found this video helpful, please like and subscribe to help our channel grow. Thank you for watching.